periodic inspections of core facilities are conducted across the St. Paul District and throughout the core year in and year out. Here we catch up with part of the inspection team as they review some of the findings at Lock and Dam 5A, about two and a half miles upstream of Winona, Minnesota on the Mississippi River. I'm Adele Braun, I'm a structural engineer with the Corps of Engineers St. Paul District and we're at Lock and Dam 5A conducting a periodic inspection of the lock. A periodic inspection looks at the condition of the lock and dam and determines if there's anything that we need to repair to ensure that it operates in a safe, effective manner for the next five years. Every five years we come out and we do this periodic inspection. And in addition to the periodic inspection, we perform a bridge inspection and a hydraulic steel structures inspection prior to that. We look through all of the concerns that people have, that the engineers and operations have, and we determine what needs to be corrected in the next five years or perhaps at the next dewatering. We perform surveys to determine if there's anything underwater also that we need to be concerned with and there's divers or in, in the lock chamber to see if there's anything that we need to be concerned with. About two years ago, we were required to do the Operation Condition Assessment Inspections, the OCA for short. And so we decided in our district that we would do the joint inspections. We would do both at the same time because both inspections include inspecting the structural, electrical, mechanical, um, the site work, the buildings. The inspection that we're doing today at Lock and Dam 5A is just a typical Lock and Dam inspection. However, all of the dams that we have in the headwaters are also inspected periodically on a five-year basis. 